This video is shooted and edited using my mobile phone. Yes, just using my mobile phone. So please watch till the end of this video to know how to edit like this. Hi guys, welcome to my new video as I promised in my last video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use mobile phone for editing a video. Four to five years ago, it was possible to edit a video like this only using a laptop or a PC with a very good graphics card. But in this 2019, it's possible from your smartphone itself. Search for a video editing app in the Play Store or App Store, you will find hundreds of applications. Out of those hundreds, maybe around five or six are efficient and powerful enough to edit videos like this. I've selected one of the best apps from those which I've been using for the last one or two months to edit my videos. Some of you must be already using this app and some of you might have heard about this application. So let's go and see which is that application. Kyle Master. Kyle Master, also pronounced as Kini Master in some areas of the world, this is the best application for video editing. Good olden days, we had Ulead Video Studio for Windows PC, which had a very minimalistic feature and a very minimalistic user interface that anyone who has a basic knowledge of English and a basic knowledge of computer could do editing from their PC. The same applies here for the Kind Master application. Anyone can study themselves about video editing. But in this video, as I promised, I will let you know how to do this type of editing. Buy a green color chart paper and shoot a video by sitting in front of the chart paper just like this. So this is how first page of Kind Master looks. Just click on uh, new project and select the aspect ratio as 16 is to 9 and this is how the interface looks in the first stage you can notice it's a very simple interface and just click on media icon and from the media browser uh, let's select a video which has a green screen background as i told earlier now let's uh, play the video and see how it is so this is the video for which i'm going to change the background and add some text effects in the background to remove the background it is mandatory that the green screen video should be in the second layer so i will add the white screen as the, my main first layer and i will create a duplicate of our uh, green screen video as a second layer like this you just need to click here and select duplicate as layer and remove the main video and drag it to the first position okay now we have moved the green screen to the second layer of the video let's uh, trim some of the portion in the background to match the length of the green screen video to avoid the cream color portion which appears in the left side of green screen video we will just crop it how to crop it you just need to scroll down and you will find a option for cropping just drag from the four corners of the green screen video this is just to make sure that the background color of the video is just green now just select the green screen video and drop it to the bottom of the screen and then select chroma key make sure you have enabled the mask adjust towards right and left in such a way that you get the background to be purely black and the foreground should be purely white you can just play around once it is set you can just click on show mask and you will find the green screen background has been removed you can do further adjustment even after disabling the mask just uh, scroll right and left to make sure that your foreground is clearer enough now as we remove the green screen background we just need to add the text effects as shown in the first video now if you don't want this white as the background you can go again to the media and uh, select any other image as the background and it's easy to do. change it uh, we will just revert to the white screen and now to add the text select the layer and select text icon and type something which you want it to be the background once you type the text adjust the size of the text and also change the font once it is done you can place it where you want it as to be a background click on these three dots and select send to back so that it appears behind my head next is to animate the text so 
first click on the text and select animation in animation and select any of the available animation so i have selected uh, in animation to be pop so this is how it looks you can adjust the duration of uh, text which you want in the video just by clicking on the text and dragging it to the left to reduce the duration we also need to select out animation so that the text effect looks good similarly you can add some other text as well i will fasten the video to reduce the length of this video shooted and edited using my mobile phone so that's it this is the end of the short video tutorial i hope you like the video kindly subscribe to my youtube channel and share this video among your friends thank you so much